I am Anil Kumar and in this video we will understand concepts about horizontal asymptotes. What is horizontal asymptote and what is the end behavior? These are the two things which we are going to understand with the help of this video. Question here is determine the equation of the horizontal asymptotes and explain the end behavior of the function. Now this dotted line shown here is the horizontal asymptote for the given function whose graph is in this bold line. What you notice here is that as x approaches negative infinity, that means when you're approaching negative infinity, f of x, the function approaches the value 2, approaches 2, right? Or you could also say that limit of the function f of x, let us say this is function f of x, as x approaches negative infinity is equal to 2. Right? Now whenever a function approaches a value, in that case we say that the horizontal asymptote exists and the equation of horizontal asymptote is the value it approaches. Right? So the y value f of x is 2. So we say y equals to 2 is equation of horizontal asymptote. Alright? Similarly, you will see that when x approaches positive infinity, in that case also the function is approaching 2. Do you see that? So here also function approaches 2. Or in other words, limit of the function f of x as x approaches positive infinity is equal to 2 and therefore from here also we can say that there is a horizontal asymptote y equals to 2. Well in this case there is only one horizontal asymptote. At times you may have two different horizontal asymptotes. Correct? So what we get here is one horizontal asymptote which is so we can write horizontal asymptote as y equals to 2. It is the value which function approaches as x value approaches infinitely large, negative or positive, right? So that is how we get horizontal asymptote. Now, second part of this question is we need to explain the end behavior, right? So that is the second part, the end behavior. End behavior really means we know it is approaching 2, but we want to see whether it approaches 2 from above or below. So here you know it is approaching from below, right? The value of the function is slightly lower than 2. In this case it approaches from above since the value of the function is slightly more than 2, right? So we could say that the limit of the function as x approaches minus infinity is 2 but negative. That means it is approaching from below, right? So it is approaching from below. And you can also say limit of the function as x approaches positive infinity is slightly more than 2. So it is approaching from above, right? So these are few terms which you need to understand as we move forward in this chapter, right? So that is also called, this is also called end behavior, right? So it is also called and behavior. So, so that is the end behavior. That means what happens to the graph of the function as you approach negative or positive infinity. I hope this point is absolutely clear. In coming videos, we'll start with the equation, find the asymptotes and behavior of the function near horizontal asymptotes or the end behavior. We'll try to figure out whether they approach from above or below. But this is general idea to explain you different terms. In the next video, we'll take up vertical and then oblique asymptotes. Thank you.